Did you know that oregano has a variety of health benefits? In this video from The Daily Eco, we explain what they are and how you can benefit from them. Properties of oregano Oregano has been extensively researched and found to possess numerous properties, such as antioxidant, antimicrobial, anti-tumor, among others. According to the World Health Organization, approximately 80% of the world's population employs plant extracts or oregano's active constituents for their primary healthcare needs. So, let's explore some of its benefits. Helps prevent diseases. Oregano's ability to protect cells from damage that can lead to aging and disease is due to its antioxidants. These antioxidants come from phenolic compounds in oregano that contain hydroxyl groups. Inhibits the growth of bacteria and fungi. Research shows that essential oils from oreganum species can fight bacteria like Salmonella typhimurium, Escherica coli, and Staphylococcus aureus, as well as fungi like Candida albicans. Helps the digestive system. It is used as a digestive to stimulate appetite, relieve gastrointestinal spams, and prevent flatulence by eliminating gas and bloating. It also has a cleansing effect on the liver and gallbladder. Relieves nasal congestion. Oregano is used to relieve the respiratory tract in bronchitis, laryngitis, and emphysema. Acts as an anti-inflammatory. This herb is used to relieve toothache, earache, and even pain in various joints. It can also be used for severe contractures or tordacolis. But before we continue, let us put you to the test. What color are the flowers of oregano? Pink, purple, white. All of the above are correct. Think about it carefully because at the end of the video, you can check if you were right. If you like The Daily Eco, remember that you can help us continue to create content like this by giving us a super thanks. How to take oregano. There are four ways to take oregano. First of all, you can prepare an oregano infusion or tea. To do this, you just need to boil water and put a handful of clean oregano leaves, either dry or fresh, in it. Let the infusion brew for a few minutes, strain and serve. Oregano can be used as a seasoning in various foods, providing them with a distinctive flavor and aroma. It is commonly added to pizzas, sauces, and dressings. However, it is important to note that the drying of the leaves for seasoning purposes can have an impact on the quality and dissemination of volatile compounds. Oregano essential oils can be ingested by adding a few drops to a drink or food. However, care should be taken when diffusing or inhaling, as only one or two drops are needed due to its high phenolic content. Topical application of the oil may cause irritation, so it is best to dilute if it's necessary. Finally, it can also be taken in capsules orally and are available in pharmacies and other stores. The recommended dose should be discussed with a medical specialist. Side effects and contraindications. Although the side effects are minimal, it can cause strong skin irritation if used topically. For this reason, we recommend that before applying it, you need to dilute it, for example, with coconut oil, olive oil, or almond oil. In general, the use of essential oils is not recommended for children under 12 years of age, pregnant and lactating women, and people under medical treatment of any kind. Also, oregano can cause allergic reactions in people sensitive to any of its components. And going back to the question we asked you before, have you thought it through? The correct answer is D. The oregano flowers can be of these three colors and appear at the end of May. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Let us know in the comments if you have or are thinking of taking oregano. Until next time.